Welcome to another MusicWorks alumni update. This is Hannah Glass and Darling, intern 123, here with Rachel Gant, intern number 71. She interned from October of 2007 to March of 2008. All right, let's get started. So Rachel, can you tell us uh, what your current job is? Yeah, so right now I work uh, contractually with Coast Music Therapy uh, full time. And would you say that MusicWorks helped you get where you are today? Yeah, absolutely. I think that MusicWorks really helped set the foundation for the music therapist that I am today. Awesome. So, so what initially drew you to the MusicWorks experience or the MusicWorks internship? Uh, I was initially drawn to it because a few of my professors at KU uh, mentioned just how fantastic of an internship it was. And once I read about it, I loved the diversity and um, learned a little bit more about Barbara. Just uh, <laughs> I just wanted to learn from her. She's just fantastic, and I loved the entire company that she built. So, so that was initially what drew you here. Yes. So once you got here, yes. what was your favorite experience? My favorite experience mm -hmm. from the whole internship. The whole thing. Um, I have to pick one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I know how hard it is for our clients to pick one. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I don't know if I have one specific one. Um, there were quite a few different situations at Scripps Hospital, mm -hmm. um, both with the breast cancer support group and with um, individual patients in their rooms that were probably the highlights of my internship experience, just those special mm -hmm. moments with those patients um, and how music uh, really was highlighted and helped bond and support those patients in those moments. So are there any aspects like perhaps worth those specific circumstances or in the internship that really helped prepare you for your career today? Uh, yeah, I would say really everything. I mean, the diversity is what originally, the diversity in Barbara, or what mm -hmm. initially drew me to music works. And I would say that those two things are really your question again. So okay, I'm going sure. To answer it wrong. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> okay. So, aspects are there any aspects of what you learned at Music Works internship that best prepared you for your career uh, yes, today? Yes. Okay. I wasn't going to answer it wrong. <laughs> um, that both of those aspects did. I just I feel like Barbara um, very much just encourages you and instills um, patience for yourself and for <laughs> others. Uh, and just really helps to let you grow as opposed to pushing you. And um, I would say that allowing myself to grow got me to a point in my internship where everything just started to click and I had that confidence so that I felt like I could step into any um, music therapy situation and be confident in the school that I made. So. But you didn't initially have that confidence at first? No, or... absolutely not. I was okay. scared to death. <laughs> Well, my next question is actually uh -huh. about challenges. Would you say okay. that was one of your biggest challenges or uh, something else? I would say a little bit. So um, music, my, just my own personal musical growth was huge mm -hmm. at MusicWorks um, and gaining that confidence just in my own musical abilities. But um, any challenges? I would say that um, it was both a challenge and actually probably another one of my favorite moments <laughs> or favorite uh, settings would be with um, substance and chemical abuse in those settings. Um, that was probably one of my biggest challenges because I was always very nervous about what to say or how to relate to the individuals there, mm -hmm. um, feeling like I maybe wouldn't be able to connect. Um, but it really wasn't. So it was actually ended up wanting, being one of my favorite sites to work at. So yeah, but I'd say that was probably one of my biggest challenges. So you kind of turned that around. Uh -huh. Wonderful. It's good to hear. Yeah. So I, you know Barbara, or at least currently, she's all about these aha moments. Yes. So I feel like that's not new. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. I just wanted to make sure that's something that's been a continual yes. thing. Okay. So what would you say is one of your aha moments? Maybe not just an internship, but in your professional life, or even personal life. I would actually say uh, we did a drum circle at the World Beat Center, hmm. and um, we each had to lead different chants and uh, just different musical aspects, and we had probably 100 or 150 people there, wow. and um, 
I would say that was my aha moment and just trusting myself because you, I would get really nervous. Like, what if I do the wrong rhythm or what if I, you know, lead someone in a, lead the group in a bad direction and everything falls apart. Uh, so that was probably my aha moment and trusting myself and just, I can't, I think going along with the confidence earlier and uh, yeah, it was probably one of the coolest music experiences I've ever had. So. The World Beat Center, did you yes. say? Yes, okay. it's in Balboa Park, I okay. believe. All right. Wonderful. Like on the edge, kind of a little bit All right. Mm -hmm. So, actually, I just have one last question yes. for you, and it's it's kind of a selfish one. Uh -huh. um, what would be your one piece of advice to future or current interns? Okay. Future or current interns? Um, say to take one piece at a time and be patient with yourself so don't go in and try to conquer it like be okay with the process and know that it's six months for a reason and that Barbara knows what she's doing with the structure and everything so really just I guess be patient with yourself is probably my biggest one yeah. good advice definitely. <laughs> thank you so much well, thank you for being here today Rachel and uh, you're welcome and best of luck to you and the rest of your future endeavors. Thank right. you very much. Thanks. You as well.